Hello, welcome to Straw Family Farm Take 2. I'm Christy. Today in the chapel we have Isaiah 117. Learn to do right, seek justice, and encourage the oppressed. So, just still trying to watch my words and do the right thing all the time. Um, okay, so this is just a super quick video. I'm super excited at how far I've gotten. I will say this jacket looks better on the dummy than it does on me. And I think it's because of this. Just saying. Okay, so I got all the pieces cut out and I got everything put together. Not real happy with the collar. Um, I probably will be finding a different collar to do uh, when I do the next one. But, and yes, I am going to do the next one. But as you can see, it comes together quite nicely. I got the sleeves. The two things that I'm going to adjust is this is not going to be as long. Um, even though I did it the same as this width right here, it does not lay the same on me. So yeah, that will go away or reduce. Let's put it that way. Um, I've got my darts. They're not exactly even. Here's the center line right here. <laughs> I kind of just laid it out. I need to measure it and redo it. They're just pinned. They're not done. Um, so and when I reduce this, these two pleats will go away. I don't really like these pleats here, um, but it is what it is. This is my first attempt at making a jacket. So I am super stoked, super happy. The only thing I have left to do is the two darts in the back. I have to hem the sleeves, which I don't think I'm going to use the cuffs. I really like the way it goes. Oops, there's my, yeah, it's my alarm. Let me know what time it is. Um, and then I just have to hem the bottom, which I have the hem ready. I just don't have it done. I have it all measured out and everything. And I have it snipped. I just have to hem it. So, uh, oh, and I have to put the uh, seam around the collar still. Um, I seamed everything out so that it would lay flat and all that good stuff. Uh, I am going to make this shorter. And I'm just going to trim it off before I hem it. Um, I'm not really liking how wide it is and it makes it kind of not want to lay like you have to fuss with it. So yeah, I will be trimming some of that back and this isn't even pressed. So it's not laying exactly like I want, but it is a white jacket. And the good thing about this is I got three yards. It was less than $17 because I also got um, a tray, a $3 tray, and I got the material for 40% off at Hobby Lobby, but I also have this big piece back here left, and I am thinking that it is long enough to be a skirt. Now, my requirements for a skirt is lower than my knees, okay, so I only want it, you know, I want it shin, and I should have enough of this to do a skirt. Um, I will have to get a cotton lining though. It's not that it's see through. I mean, I don't know if you guys can see that. It's not see through, but I don't know. It's just for me, I like to have something lined. So I, I just don't like to take that chance if I decide to wear black underwear, or something, which I don't. I try to match my underwear, but you know what I mean? I don't want anything showing through it. So I probably will get some, uh, what do you call it? Some cotton and just line it. But I think it has turned out pretty good. I will be putting the finishing touches on it. I did Tori's hair on Saturday or no on Sunday. And that's when I cut out all the pieces and then I started sewing it together, screwed up the collar once, had to take it off, which I'm using clear thread because I don't like how many, there's just too many different shades of white. And so I just went ahead and got some clear thread and did that. And so taking the collar back off was a pain, but yeah, we went to the car show Saturday, which if you watch the crochet, you knew that. And then Sunday I did Tori's hair Sunday morning. I actually saw RJ too. So it's been a pretty good weekend. So all my kids did some sewing, some crochet, went to a car show. It's a pretty good weekend. So, um, I do have to get ready for work and I just super quick wanted to show you how this is turning out. Um, 
the adjustments that I will make next time is this will not be as wide and the arms will be wider um, just up here at the top. So, yeah. It fits, it's just, it's not restricting because the material moves, but it definitely is a little tighter than I want it. So I am pretty happy with the way it's turning out and I will see you next week and hopefully it'll be done. Bye.